And Ian. And it's been a while since we've done one, yep. because we've been busy. Um, yep. But we're here today to do some movie reviews and talk about movies and possibly games, you know. So, let's begin, shall we? Alright, so we have... Tarzan. Tarzan. The Legend of Tarzan. Yeah. With um, Alexander Skarsgård, I think his name is. I think so. Margot Robbie yep. and um, Sam Jackson, right? Yep. Okay. So, um, I'll, my opinion is that as I watched the film, I just think, I kept thinking of the Disney Tarzan film. Yeah. I was like, <clears throat> this is not a bad live ad live action adaptation of the yeah, cartoon that's what they were going for. What? That's what they were going for. I mean, parts, yeah, I parts, think, are, parts are clearly were not based off it. They just kind of went, yeah, we'll do this for... Yeah, so know. I thought it was decent for what it was, but what do you think of it? You it know? was good. Wow, that's actually, like... Yeah. Like... Watching it, I'm like... He has I, he, he has <laughs> much stronger or stricter taste in than I do when it comes to films. So yeah, when, if, the, he thi- if he thinks it's too. good, it depends on the movie too. Depends on the movie too. So <laughs> he has a very stricter taste. So when he says something's good, it's probably actually decently good. Yeah. So like, I thought Alexander Skarsgård, you know, like I was unexpected, but hey, you know, why not? You know, yeah. he's he's a big tall guy, um. Mm-hmm. So why not? You know, I thought Mark. The best part of the film was Margot Robbie. Every yep. scene with Margot <laughs> yeah. Robbie was the best part of the scene. Like the best part of the films. Like. That one scene where she like, oh, and your mustache is a little lower on the left than it is on the right. You know that, right? It's like, ah. Like, really? You had to put that in there? Ah. That's like, she, like it's like they're going for the Harley Quinn Margot Robbie in this film. But at the same time, they're not. I just thought, you know, like, ah, oh, Margot Robbie, she saved this film. Like, I mean, Alexander Skarsgård, he's cool and all. Um, he fights like Batman, which I thought was really weird. In the, well, he fights the, like in the beginning. I'm thinking in the beginning, but really when they got the Batman style with the, you know, gorilla. Well, yeah, yeah, he, f- he fights like a gorilla because yeah. he was trained. Right, but they aren't, he's like, still with, like, oh, the Batman fight. I'm like, okay, that's interesting. You yeah, know, I, thought, you're dead, I thought it was pretty cool. And he blows someone up. I'm like, all right, well, that's clearly off. That's just, you know, mm-hmm. that's in every movie now. You have to have an explosion somewhere, I guess. He had to have a big explosion. Christoph Waltz, you know, I thought he was mm-hmm. all right. I, I would recognize him. <laughs> you didn't recognize I couldn't him? recognize him. I recognized Jim Broadband, though. The guy who did Slug One in Harry Potter. Jim Broadband. That's the guy who was trying to convince him in the first place before Sam Jackson interfered and said, Oh, that fuckhead. guy. The guy with the, yeah. the weird yeah, hair. Yeah, before Jackson in the interrupted said, Listen, fuckhead. He ain't gonna listen to you. <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I totally forgot about like, <laughs> like, oh, like, the, the very oh, British you. individual. Yeah, I'm like, Oh, it's you. Great. The very British the individual with the British 18th, uh, the 19th century hair, yeah. Victorian hair. <laughs> I mean, the humor was spot on funny for majority of it, too. Like, Sam uh, yeah, Jackson like, had some funny lines. Like, Sam Jackson, you sure you don't want to kill him? I'm like, you look at his balls, right? No. <laughs> Come on. Yeah, you, the, were, the, you were the, going. The, you were thinking about it. The, the humor <laughs> was good. But like, like I said. It was bland, but it worked with his blood. It's like, oh, by the way. It, it was bland. Talk, but at the it's, same it's, time. It's like a one-off. Too. You're not talking about skin. Yeah, well, like I said, though, I think Margot Robbie was one of the better parts of the yeah. film. Like, she definitely, like, yeah. like instead of a classic damsel in distress... She's like mixture, a Star Wars mixture with an actual. She's damsel. like she's like a damsel mixed with like a Mary Sue. So she's like <laughs> she has levels of damsel, but she has levels of Mary Sue. Yeah. As such, it's like yes. But for Harley's sake, it's gonna work perfectly because Harley's. Well, I'd say like I don't think Harley. Of, I don't think Harley is a Mary Sue. She's a different type of. She's a level different beyond. Type of like damsel. she's a, she's, just, she's a special, special damsel. I don't think she's a da- <laughs> she's like a special. She, well, she just. She knows how to fight. That's and she knows what the fuck she wants. Yeah. Which is what Jane did this one, too. But, she did the same thing this one. The guy said, yeah, what the fuck I want. Yeah. I can dish your mustache. I can dish whatever I want. I can kill you. <sighs> so cool. I can swim for crocodile, which you can't do, apparently. I can mm-hmm. try and bring you young girls, which is not going to work. That was weird. I thought I thought <laughs> it was pretty good, though. Yeah. Um, <laughs> the brother bug is like, that's your brother? Well, he used to be. <laughs> <laughs> well, she he used like, to be. Shit. <laughs> There was like I had one scene in question when I saw the film, but now mm-hmm. I can't remember the qu- uh, the scene in question. Like I love the Lion King fiasco. All the animals charging down, like like what, what, what was, like, was like a wildebeest type Disney thing. I'm like, okay, that's a Disney thing. That's a Disney. Novel. Wildebeest. Uh, Disney would no, have. It was Disney Warner Brothers. Right, no, I'm saying it was a Disney type thing. Like, a Disney would have something like, like a massive army of 
just animals coming but down. But it was Warner Brothers, so they like, yeah. hmm, it's like, hmm. I don't think it was Disney asking me to like, better. I wonder how much we can use um, Disney stuff in this film. It's like, this is Tarzan, so Part we're going to have to use Tarzan stuff. Maybe and it takes place in Africa. Maybe we can use some Lion King crap. It was directed <laughs> it was like, very well. It wasn't like it wasn't horrendous by David Yates. It wasn't directed like shit like half these movies are. Who directed? Um, what else did David Yates direct? The last four Harry Potter movies, from Order of the Phoenix to Deathly Hallows Two. Well, I like Deathly Hallows Part Two, and yeah. I like Order of the Phoenix. I thought was fine. Uh, okay, I mean that. I think that's the least favorite of the Harry Potter films. Only favorite of the books, or maybe it's the least favorite of the books. One of them. We're going to talk about it later, but same director. Harry Potter, so, so, that's why I brought it up, though. Same director. Anyway, I thought it was decent. Like, I'd I give it, like, a 7 I think we directed something else we saw, but I don't remember what the hell it was. What? I think we directed something else we both saw, but I don't remember what the hell it was either. Mm, I should probably look it up later. There's too many directors! There's a lot of directors. Jesus! <laughs> but that's okay. Something like, Star Wars has one or two or three. Those are fine. You know, yeah, they, but they, that's because, like, it was they, they owned they by an individual man Right, yeah, years. right. Also, it's, like, it's also... It's their versions of the thing. It works fine. You have Batman made by guys fine. And then you get all these other people. Well, Batman. Like 90 like, versions of Batman. Like, there's too many Batman films and there's too many yeah. Batman directors. Anyway, that we're going off topic. Right, but same thing. There's too topic. many directors. That's Batman's case in point. It's way too many themes. Some work. Some are... Yeah. Which anyway, we're, we're going off topic here. Yeah. So let's get back into it. What do you think? Mm. Like, as a it score, was... like, what would you give it? Nine. Really? <laughs> yeah. I'd give it like a I seven. I could actually stand Jackson. I'm mean, going to finally figure out why I don't like him. What? Because he plays the same asshole in every movie. I finally figured out that's partly why I don't like him. For Avengers, it kind of works if Tony Stark being a douche. In this case, like, you don't really need that. But he did, they, they chopped it, they did enough that it didn't piss me off and didn't want me to kill him. Yeah, well, people, like, you know. Put him with a ghost. He's famous for his, like, his phrases, but, you know, he in never. This was very subtle. It was like, I barely know what he was I'm like, oh, well, you. I'm like, oh, great. I barely even recognize. I'm like, oh, Sam Jackson it, being Then insane. if you want to blame someone, blame Quentin Tarantino for yeah. essentially making him and everything in all his films and essentially mm. doing the same. Black guy, <laughs> however old he is, like like. I mean, in certain game. movies it works, like comedy such as that one over there, Men in Black type. That type of work is written. It's written a, no, it wasn't. He wasn't not, I'm not saying it's written that way. It's one thing. It's, when it's not written that way. It's my problem. Oh, okay. okay. It's written like a sane, like a sane person. What well, bad motherfucker? No, get out. He's ha he has an issue with Sam and certain, Jackson and certain people for the same reason. He's that's my reason. Tom Cruise. I still can't figure that out. I still can't figure. Oh, out. I don't like him. He's a he's a great action. Actor, you're like he does his own stunts. Did you? I know? just can't figure out why I don't like him. But mm. that's anyway, it's another rant. But seven, you know. nine. All right. Catch you guys later. If you like animals being ridiculous, if you like good, what type of movie this be? Um, fantasy mixed with realistic, kind of because it's a little bit realistic because it is realistic. It's history. It's based. historical fiction. Historical fiction. If you like stuff like that, like the movie, you know, it's good. Historical fiction. Yep. Catch you guys later. Bye.